Good morning. I'm Ian Monbud, one of the crew members here at the Historic Ship Nautilus Submarine Forest Museum in Groton, Connecticut. Today I'm going to be talking about Commander Samuel David Dealey. Commander Samuel Dealey had many nicknames, including Torpedo Toten Texan, Destroyer Killer, and Submariner Submariner. He took no pride in sinking the enemy, but realized that they must all be sunk the sooner the better for all of the warring nations. Born on September 13, 1903 in Dallas, Texas, Dealey was named for his father who came from a wealthy family. His uncle was the man that Dealey Plaza in Dallas was named for, which was the place where President Kennedy would be assassinated in 1963. Dealey admitted that he was not very good at math and actually failed at the Naval Academy. He was fortunate enough to get a second chance where he performed well. His career started on surface ships, including the USS Nevada, which would be one of the battleships sunk at Pearl Harbor. When World War II began, Dealey was the commanding officer of the USS S-20, a training ship here at Groton, Connecticut. On December 2, 1942, he commissioned the USS Harder as commanding officer. Harder made six war patrols, sinking a total of 16 enemy ships, and was even intentionally grounded twice, once to save a pilot and once to retrieve a group of Australian coast watchers. Both times were on Japanese-held islands. On Harder's fifth war patrol between the islands of Tawi-Tawi and Burma, five Japanese destroyers were sunk over the course of five days, earning Dealey his destroyer killer nickname. This action eventually earned him the Medal of Honor, but it became mired in personal animosity between two flag officers. Harder went on to do a sixth war patrol where it was part of a wolf pack patrolling the Philippines. On August 24, 1944, they moved to attack two Japanese ships, including one captured U.S. destroyer. In the ensuing fight, the USS Harder and Commander Dealey were sunk by death charges. Harder received the Presidential Unit Citation for its war patrols. Dealey was awarded four Navy crosses, a Silver Star, and the Army's Distinguished Service Medal, presented by General MacArthur himself. The Medal of Honor was awarded to him posthumously for the Harder's Fifth War Patrol and reads as follows. For conspicuous gallantry and intrepidity at the risk of his life above and beyond the call of duty as commanding officer of the USS Harder during the Fifth War Patrol in Japanese-controlled waters, floodlit by a bright moon and disclosed to an enemy destroyer escort which bore down with intent to attack, Commander Dealey quickly dove to periscope depth and waited for the pursuer to close range, then opened fire, sending the target and all aboard down in flames with his third torpedo. Plunging deep to avoid fierce depth charges, he again surfaced and within nine minutes after sighting another destroyer, had sent the enemy down tail first with a hit directly amidship. Evading detection, he penetrated the confined waters off Tawi Tawi with the Japanese fleet base six miles away and scored death blows on two patrolling destroyers in quick succession. With his ship heeled over by concussion from the first exploding target and the second vessel nosediving in a blinding detonation, he cleared the area at high speed. Sighted by a large hostile fleet force on the following day, he swung his bow toward the lead destroyer for another down-the-throat shot, fired three bow tubes, and promptly crash-dived to the be terrifically rocked seconds later by the exploding ship as Harder passed beneath. This remarkable record of five vital Japanese destroyers sunk in five short-range torpedo attacks attests the valiant fighting spirit of Commander Dealey and his indomitable command. 